Afternoon guys and welcome to another uh, episode of Normal or Paranormal here on the GSI YouTube channel. Now this one has been sent in by Callum, thanks very much for this Callum via our Instagram pages. Um, and a little bit of backstory, Callum was uh, walking with his girlfriend up at Codner Castle. Uh, we've been there many times and he was just snapping away, it was a nice sunny day snapping away and he took a picture of one of the farmhouse doors um, the door was no longer there it's just the doorway um, and he got this image which I'm putting up on the screen for you just now now as you can see what it looks like is in the top sort of left corner there seemed to be sort of like a face what looks like a woman's face um, I don't know you can just make out the nose the eyes the mouth the hair at the back um, but it is quite vague um, now this picture that I'm showing you now is blown up through one of our filters just to try and highlight the picture and the image just a little bit more um, needless to say obviously when we showed this to Callum he was quite excited um, it could it be an actual spirit um, so we did a few more tests I sent the picture the first picture which uh, I showed you to Vicky who's a professional photographer um, she looked at it, she was concerned about certain light anomalies um, so I ran it through a few more filters and the next picture that you're seeing, um, the purple uh, face I think that was without um, some of the colour saturation but it highlights others and again as you can see in the doorway it looks like a face and the next one, the blue one um, again, you can see uh, the nose, the eyes, what looks like to be hair, um, excuse me, what to be hair at the back. Um, we've circled it so you can basically make out the facial features. After speaking to Vicky, um, she again she said it's really interesting, but I'm not actually quite sure. There was something that was playing on her mind uh, as a professional photographer. So I was due to do my solo investigation, as it happened to be at Codner Castle. So I thought I'd take some gear up and have a look myself. Um, so we went up. Um, I had Ralph, who was about half a mile away, he walked up with me and then he walked back. Um, so I could conduct the investigation on my own. And uh, the first place I went to was the farmhouse and had a look around. Um, now, as with the first picture, you've got sort of like uh, the face in the back uh, left corner. Um, behind that to the right, behind a wooden beam, there was an open window. And the wall, uh, there was a wall, sorry, um, which had been painted white. Now, the, what it actually was, um, as it turns out, unfortunately, it wasn't a spirit at all. It was light shining in through the open window, right onto the wall. So the face that you can see is where the light is actually hitting the wall. Um, and the paint had peeled off uh, to reveal an eyes, nose, and sort of what looked like mouth. Um, and because uh, Callum's exposure uh, on his phone had left uh, the surroundings dark and highlighted what looked like uh, the face, that's why it was showing up. Uh, unfortunately, it wasn't. I could say it was just a, a massive, unhappy coincidence where light was hitting this particular face making everything else in the room dark um, and it was making it look like there was actually a face um, peering from the door we got quite excited at first but unfortunately you know we're our, we're there to debunk um, so we can get excited by the things that we can't debunk um, obviously um, if it's you know, you cross all these things off your list when you go out and 99% of the time it's, it's usually normal phenomena uh, but it's that 1% that we're looking for unfortunately on this occasion uh, there was a rational explanation for it. it turned out to be paint peeling on a wall and light hitting it and the exposure on Callum's uh, camera uh, had only picked that up but it just goes to show that sometimes when you think you know, you see all these images and you think, crikey, I've actually got something there. Investigate it yourself. Actually go and physically investigate it because have you. Um, but yeah, thanks again to Callum for sending us that in. We hope you enjoyed this, guys. If you've got any pictures for us or any photos or 
videos that you want us to take a look at and run it through uh, certain programs that we've got which we can let Vicky take a look at them and see if we can uh, try and get to the bottom one for you please send them to our Instagram account which is GSI Paranormal IG um, please stay safe everybody um, stay tuned hopefully um, lockdown we will be getting out at some point once lockdown ends in the middle of February um, but I hope we can bring up a, a little bit of other footage or other things onto the channel for you in the meantime. So please everybody stay safe, please like and subscribe if you've not already done so and uh, we'll see you in the next video.